Hi there, my name is Mike with Precision Orthotics and Prosthetics and today I'm going to go ahead and show you how to fit the Aspen LSO which is more of the surgical type of brace if you don't need an actual custom one. They do call this the 637 which is just the code that's associated with it so you don't really have to worry about that but this is the more surgical type of back brace here. If you saw our other videos you did see our least aggressive, our mid grade and now this is going to be more of the supportive time there. They do have some extensions that we don't have currently on this brace here for a front panel to actually come up over the shoulders and pull the shoulders back but this is going to be mainly for like a, a lumbar surgery or a thoracic surgery or something like that that they need a little extra containment. So on this brace here this is really nice because you get a lot of different options on it. It's a wrap around design just like we had on our other ones here but the nice thing you get a spine cut out so any incision that you had to do for surgery does have the relief pressure to go ahead and give you that relief pressure to your back because it's already in pain there. Now we have this side panels here as well if they need a little extra cinching you have it if you don't need that extra cinching you have a button here on the bottom you go ahead and just pop that panel off and you have less support there same with this thoracic area you go ahead and push these two buttons you pop that off as well now the really nice part about this brace though is after you're done with the surgery you've done your healing your doctor has approved you to go ahead and go to less support this brace will go to our other brace if you did see it our 627 our mid grade it will go down to the mid grade all you have to do is unvelcro it there's a little tab down here you pop it off and now you have our mid grade brace i will go ahead and show you how to fit this just in case you guys didn't see our other videos but it is going to be the same way. We're going to wrap it around. We're going to stand up straight. We're going to go ahead and cinch those strings to go ahead and give us the pressure. And then you're going to have your support for four to six weeks or until the doctor says you don't need it. Just make sure you're not wearing it all the time unless the doctor did advise you to wear it all the time because you don't want to atrophy. So my model is going to go ahead and come on in here. I'm going to show you how to put it on. So you're going to go ahead and come to the top of the tailbone again. You're going to go ahead and wrap it around the body and cinch it in. And then you're going to go ahead and take that and make sure that everything is nice and tight. So make sure it's tight. Take those strings. Go ahead and stand up as straight as you can. Pull it and lock it in. So that's all it is for that. And if you do have any questions, please give me a call here at Precision Orthotics and Prosthetics. Either myself or my staff would be happy to help you guys. Thank you so much and have a great day.